the project is King's College Circle, Hard House Circle, Tower Road. The goal is to remove parking, to, to get it out of the historic core. You know, we have a laneway in parking that's nine meters wide. We only have one meter, a sidewalk, for the pedestrians. I think it's a great idea because usually when I come to class in the morning, there's so many students, it's really hard to like get everyone to get on this like small area, so it'll be really nice. It gets dangerous at times and with so like the onslaught of students walking to and from medical science buildings and Con Hall, it's just safer. So I'm just walking on like I'm trying to get to my next class with my boys, whatever. And then the guy just drives right in front, <laughs> reflex arc, I have to jump backwards and like shine my toes. It will be a big change to the U of T landscape. A plan to remove all the cars from King's College Circle, making the historic core of the university a pedestrian only space. But this means the administration needs to find a new home for almost 400 parking spaces. Students are the primary parkers on that space. We have to replace the spots. I mean, if, if we're not going to lose the parking spaces and there will be an, altern uh, an alternative given to drivers, then I'm all for it. Uh, it would sadden me somewhat. I think this is a really central place to park. It's very nice. It's very campus central. Before the final decision on the design proposals is made in November, the university is seeking feedback from as many students as possible across all three campuses. Go to landmark.utoronto.ca to take the survey and tell U of T what you think. For the Varsity News, I'm Sal Bassalano.